Hey guys, so today I'm going to be looking at funny test answers. Yeah, let's just get right into the video. It has been a while since I've looked at one of these, like probably like five years ago. Would you rather be stuck on an island all alone or with one person you hate? Why? I would rather be on an island with someone I hate so I have something to eat. Oh, yo, this could be thinking different. Thinking outside the box, man. Oh my gosh. Okay. I wouldn't want to mess with this kid. So just one cause of deforestation in this paper. <laughs> Yo, the little tick. <laughs> you got me, kid. You got me. I wonder how many points he got for that. Did he get a tick? Seriously? What? Why aren't my teachers like that? <laughs> Finish the sentence. If I had the principal's job, I would quit and get a job I'd enjoy. <laughs> True. <laughs> but then again, I feel like principal's jobs aren't that stressful. Are they? I feel like a teacher's job would be more stressful. Write as many words with the same pattern, uck. The person writing this question knew what they were doing. Truck, luck, buck, duck, tuck, muck, F word, yuck, stuck. <laughs> Seriously, the person knew what they were doing when they were like, I know the kids are gonna write the F word. Alice places a prepared slide on her microscope. But when she looks into it, she can't see anything. So just one reason why not. She is blind. Yo. <laughs> right? Yeah. That could be one answer too, you know? Why though? Is it because you need to like take off the little slide? Dude, I don't know the answer to this, man. <laughs> I would write the same thing. Motivate your answer. Go answer. Go. Motivate your answer. I've never seen a question written like that. Wouldn't it just be like, yeah, give a reason why. Motivate your answer. <laughs> okay. You got it. You got this. Write a question using why. Why? Yeah. Why? You know, work smart, not hard. <laughs> Rachel has 16 chocolate bars. Tracy takes four from her and asks for the remainder quarter. What will she end up with? A slap. <laughs> Yes, in real life, she would end up with a slap. Mm -hmm. This person is just being realistic. Not the answer I was looking for. All right, Karen, you just have no sense of humor. Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune have at least three things in common. List them. One, they are all planets. Two, they are all round. Three, none of them have McDonald's. True. Very true. Draw a small clock that shows 10 minutes past 11. 11, 10. Ah. Oh. Uh, why are they wrong man they just chose to use a digital clock not an analog clock you have to specify man i feel like questions gotta specify else it's up to anyone to interpret it if someone in the audience cannot hear you you probably need to increase your volume if the speaker never changes his rate or pitch he might be speaking in a monotone if someone suggests that you are slurring your words you need to work on your alcoholism Ah. Uh. Oh, okay. What's the actual answer? You need to work on your speech? I don't even know, man. What the? <laughs> what kind of questions are these? You see she's getting angry. You felt that feeling too. Describe a time when you felt angry. When I found this homework in my backpack. What did you do? Did it. <laughs> you did it. They did it at least. Oh. Marcus is the strongest kid in second grade. He used to lift 12 pounds. Now he can lift 97 pounds. How much more can he lift now? Marcus is on steroids. <laughs> wow, kids know these kind of things. Jeez. I don't even know what steroids were when I was a kid. I was a dumb kid. Jackie, you can't just write out a question you don't want to answer. They tried. Jackie really tried. Ten bluebirds sometimes trap. The mother duck lays eggs. An American eagle is illegal to cook. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Oh, true. Draw a polygon with exactly six sides. Be sure to use a ruler. Use a crayon to color each vertex of your polygon. How many vertices did you color? Answer, six. What is the name of the polygon you drew? Answer, hot dog. No. <laughs> it's hot dog. Okay, I named the polygon hot dog. Name a location, country or region or area that is sparsely populated, the ocean. State one significant physical reason why the area named above is sparsely populated. Because humans can't breathe underwater. Why is that wrong? 
that's such a good answer. <laughs> I would take it. I would. In your opinion, at which location would be the most dangerous during a tornado? Circle one. <laughs> Explain your choice. It is way too dangerous to circle a tornado. <laughs> yeah. Don't go outside and try to circle a tornado. Don't do that. Come up with an equation that is true when x equals 7. Be creative. You can make the equation as simple or as complex as you want. x equals 7. Really? That's right though, teacher. Write these words in alphabetical order. Oh, it, I love, a su, a lorry. <laughs> Man, hey, technically they didn't specify what they actually meant. The cookie recipe called for one cup of butter, four cups of flour, a half cup of sugar, and four teaspoons of vanilla. But Sarah only has a half cup of butter. Explain how Sarah could still make the cookies without going to the store or borrowing from a neighbor. Still. <laughs> yeah, Sarah needs to steal now. Okay, she's gone to the dark side. What's the answer though? Just half of everything now? Ah. Where have you smelled burned fat before? At the gym. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Circle the smallest number. One, two, three. That's right though, technically. Like, that is right. Why would you... Come on now. Maybe they just didn't know if the numbers were included. <laughs> ah, technically, it is right. Your calculator is showing 2,942. What would you put into the calculator to make the twos become sixes? After you clear the number, you punch in 694 and then another 6. Then you have 6946. Oh, as in they wanted times 3 kind of thing. Ah. Oh. But this person was like, why would you need to times 3 when you could just clear the number and then just type it again? Stupid. What sort of difficulties would a blind person face on a day-to-day -day basis? Seeing. Oh. <laughs> True. Driving. Date. No thanks. I would like to stay single. Good choice. Girlfriends are expensive and a lot of work. <laughs> well, the teacher really did it like that. Yes, kid. Just stay single forever because girls are no good. Suppose you wanted to build a house on this land and still protect its natural resources. What could you do? How would it protect the natural resources? You can just forget about the house. <laughs> True. Just don't build a house then. Find the difference between 8 and 6. 8 is all curly, 6 is not. No. <laughs> yeah. 8 technically has two circles and 6 only has one circle. Yeah. List four ways we can communicate other than sending a letter through the mail. A. Twitter. B. Facebook. C. FaceTime. D. Grinder. Oh. I guess someone doesn't know what Grinder is. Well, that's it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me in the comments down below what your thoughts are. And as always, thanks for watching. Hope you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.